congratulations to Paranormal Patrick for hitting 1K. Yeah, wow. 1K. Face to ace, hitting 1K. Yup. Are you sure you live? Yeah. It's, it says I'm live. There's 30 seconds. 37 to 40. <laughs> So how's everybody doing in the chat? There you go. There you go. I got it. I didn't even get a thing either. I just got it too now. My, my internet might be in the in here today. Hey, Christina. Hey, her. Thank you for coming. Debbie. Hey, Stace. Thank you for coming. Yeah, Pat Regan. Hey, face to face. Christina. E.T. What up, face? Trying to get E.T. up here, y'all. Debbie, what's going on? Christina, how you doing, Christina? <laughs> we sent you a link on uh, X or Twitter. Uh, go into your mail and click on it, and it should bring you right to us. Hey, Melissa. Melissa. At Melissa. Hey, Kylie. <clears throat> Paranormal Kylie hit 1K today. I'm at Paranormal Patrick. Hey, Debbie. Hey, right Debbie. Back. Slint, uh, Patrick. Hey, Patrick. <clears throat> Patrick, I bet you that wheelbarrow's heavy now. You're carrying around 1K one, one subscribers. You watching WWE? I think Bat Rican's watching WWE too. I find my remote. <laughs> <laughs> Probably behind one of them Batmans. Could have sworn I had it on, on my desk. Maybe he heard, uh, heard WWE on your TV. There you go. <coughs> E.T. E.T. E. How's it going, man? What's going, man? I'm not used to this. What's going, man? Can't hardly really figure out the camera on this. There we go. That looks better. Look at Amy now. There we go. That looks better. I hear echo. Uh, do you, you have YouTube playing in the background? Yeah. yeah. You gotta mute the sound. I want. There we go. Yeah, I just left it up for the chat. My bad. Dude, I had the remote the whole time in my freaking pocket. What the uh, heck? At least I wasn't in your fridge in your refrigerator. Yeah. <laughs> That's where I find my keys. I was watching a video the other day. This guy was um, sweeping his driveway, and then. Um, he done something and went back in there and he come back out and he couldn't find his uh, broom. So he was looking around for the broom and went back into the garage and got another broom, uh, broom and he had the other broom in his hand the whole time. <laughs> so what's good, E.T.? Batman stole it, really? <laughs> Not a whole lot, man. I can't hardly see the freaking chat. I had a phone. It's hard. Yeah, it's hard to see the chat from the phone. Yeah, yeah. you have to like go back and forth. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. I was talking about the laptop. Oh, and the laptop. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, look up at the top. It says comments. Yeah. Click on it. No. Yeah, I don't see it. Oh, okay, the it's got a of- like a drop down menu. Oh no. Oh, that's right. You're in StreamYards. Yeah. So, yeah, the comments are at the top right. Click that. 
That's yeah, kind of weird. Uh, yeah, he did a virtual uh, live stream the other day. But I was talking to uh, this guy today, and he was showing us how to uh, turn it wide. You know, wide says straight up and down. And if you turn it wide, you can, like, make your people mod. If you do a virtual, it won't let you do the mods. Uh, hmm. I haven't tried the vertical just yet. I want to try that tomorrow, though, I think. The what? The vertical live oh. streaming. I want to give that a try tomorrow. Man, I really want to do that, but you got to have a thousand subs. Really? So but you vertical? can record. I've done one vertical live, but you got to invite people. If you got a thousand subs, it sends out the uh, notifications like it does for the shorts. Oh, really? What do you do yeah. the vertical live? I didn't know that. It's uh, supposed to reach, reach, reach out to more. Sort of funny, I do it up instead of this way. Yeah, but I'm talking about... Um, yeah, I started a certain... For time. YouTube or... Really? Yeah, for YouTube, yeah. I did it once, uh, Vertical Live. Um, Thank you. But... I knew I had it, to do it, it this never, way TikTok. I never stuck. It never stuck to my uh, channel. Yeah, there was one I saw that said Ben Rican is live, and they went in there and it said the video is private. I don't know why I said that. Maybe I missed it and it just didn't didn't uh, post online or whatever. I never put anything private. <laughs> <laughs> now, I was uh, with her on uh, BJ's live and he was showing it, uh, showing us how to uh, work that virtual where you can do more things with it. So I don't know. I'm just now trying to figure out stream yours, much less another thing. So I just put my name as ET Paranormal because Face Dace is constantly teasing me. <clears throat> Did you get your uh, uh, comments straightened out? Uh, well, yeah, I just I got to wear my cheaters, man, or I can't see them. I do like me. I, I look on my phone uh, or my tablet or something. I use it for my comments. Yeah, I need mine for when I, I'm looking at things close up. <laughs> you know, I need to look close. Yeah, I'm the same way. I've got good vision from far away, but not yeah. for reading. Right? Yeah, I can't see that. <laughs> you're in front of my face. I'm blind. <laughs> well, wow, you're here? Oh. Thank you, <laughs> Just guys. Thank you, Davey. No. Step away a couple, a couple feet. And yeah, oh, there you are. <laughs> I'm going to turn this light up and wash it up. Ah. ah, there you guys go. <laughs> I need to give me some glasses, man. It's getting where I can't see to drive at night. I hate that. I hate the dusk when it's like, in like just getting dark. That's when I have a hard time seeing. When it's totally dark, I'm fine. When it's but is that that in between period? Well, some um, purple, bright purple, bluish lights, man. That's what gets me every time. They, when I pass one of them, I lose the whole road. I just hold on to the steering wheel and hit the gas pedal. Yeah, just me opening my eyes gets me. Johnny, small pepper, hey. Hey, Johnny, thank you for coming, brother. Hey, what's going on? Yeah, we were sitting here thinking, and we're trying to figure out. I, I thought we know we've heard your name before, but we neither one of us could remember what it was, so I couldn't find your messenger. And I said, "Well, he's on uh, X or Twitter," so that's how we ended up finally getting you. Hey, Florida. Florida. Hi, Florida. I figured yeah, they face. Know. They um, they were just deleting everybody who was on a uh, on a uh, moderating the live last night, and <laughs> all of her uh, all of her moderators were timing everybody out and deleting people over ignorant stuff. Man, I mean, they weren't even they like saying girls can't drive, and boom, they blocked them. Oh, you're going to ruin her channel. Yeah, wow. Hey, hey Slim, you hit 700, dude. 700? Yeah. Wow. Nice. I ain't done nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't done nothing. <clears throat> That's like I was at three something, man. I woke up next day and I was like close to five. I said, what is going on here? 
Well, I was just getting ready to hit 500, and then it backs up another two. So I think it's like 497 again. Oh, God, really? Man, I, yeah. I was like 390, 97 yeah. forever. I'm wanting to get this other channel up and running, but just hurry up and wait. I hate to hear that about the kitty cat. The cat got surgery. Yeah. What happened to it, Warren? You had a neuter and spade. What, what, what is neuter and spade, though? I mean, what is that? That's where they... Uh, if, you, the parts. <laughs> if you... <laughs> That's something. They cut something them off. Something to hold all the people on to get. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Casey's dog is neutered, and uh, um, all of Cameron's friends got dogs, and they they've been clipped. Boo's the only one that hasn't been clipped. So, and Cameron said, "I'm not doing it. I might want to breed because those are expensive dogs, man. I mean, he got a deal on it for six hundred bucks. I mean, that thing is usually like eighteen hundred dollars. We've got a chocolate lab we want to breed, but you got to wait till they're two years old. Yeah." Mm. But he's so daggone hyper, though. He's almost <laughs> he's almost sixty pounds and acts like a chihuahua. How old is he now? He's about eight months. He's going on nine oh, months old. Yeah. A pup. Yeah, he's still a pup. That's oh, why. A pup. But I tell you what, though, man, we take him to public. Like uh, we take him for training, and I always take him to the ice cream shop, you know, to get him a little ice cream as a treat. And uh, when he's in public, he's perfect. No problems. He don't act up. He gets in line. He lays down. He doesn't like bark at anybody. <laughs> He's just perfect. You get him home, it's a different, <laughs> it's a whole different story. Well, that's like Boone. I put a little short today of me throwing the ball at Boone. I call him Spot, but his name's Boone. And he's, you know, I got to take him outside and run him for a while. He's hyper, man. Yeah. <laughs> Then I'm still I'm trying to get him to start retrieving so we can try to get him into like duck hunting. That's what we're doing. I'm gonna I'm teaching him to hunt sheds, deer sheds. So he can go out in the woods and find deer antlers. Yeah. It's crazy how them dogs like them rescue dogs, man, they can find people that's been buried under like eight foot of snow or mud. I'm afraid this guy's gonna come back with the whole dang deer. <laughs> Probably will drag big food out on you. <laughs> gonna drag him down. Yeah, I wanted to start taking him traveling <laughs> with us when we're going and doing our investigations. He'll calm down. He gets a little older, he'll start calming down. Boone's calmed down a whole lot, but he's still a little hyper when he don't get the chance to run. He what kind of dog is he? He's a German short hair pointer. Oh yeah. I he's thought he said I yeah. thought he says he's a German hair porn. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. God, my, 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 my female dog was in heat, man, and God, my, it drove him crazy. I didn't know which one was worse. And then the other dog was supposed to be neutered, but he was still acting crazy. I was like, what? Is, what why was he used to have him neutered? The are cats well, and us, he was already in case he rescued him. So they uh they neuter him, so they won't have any kids. But that doesn't doesn't mean that they can't have any action. Yeah, their mind's still there. Somebody drop your links and share if you ain't connected with each other. Connect. That's a new. Uh, I think that's a new theme for uh, subscribing. Is connecting. Yeah, because uh, YouTube doesn't like saying when you say subscribe or whatever. Yeah. Really? Well, yeah, I guess I don't know what it is, but uh, what the heck? Shut up. He loves some birds, <laughs> David. He loves birds. Every time he opens the door, he doesn't sing the birds, and there he goes. Finally. But I don't like hunting that much anymore i hunted ever since i was little and I, don't, I don't really do that much anymore well i don't either um but my son he he does and he goes duck hunting and that's what he got the dog for <coughs> was for duck hunting but when he got him here he just become a house you know or 
family dog, and I get him. I I get out there and work with him a little bit. I mean, he'll. I got to get you know. I want to get one of them guns to shoot some artificial ducks out, so to teach him to pick it up and bring it back. Cause we had one that you they like, put in a thing and threw it, and but he was younger then, and he just chewed it up and <laughs> had to go out there and pick up the cotton. <laughs> Yeah, we live out in the middle of the woods, so all the deer and stuff are like our pets now. It's not fair to hunt them. Yeah, they come out. I mean, you can walk outside and they're right there and they won't run or nothing. It's crazy. I can't hunt. I I, I, I can't. I can't bear to see any animal getting hurt. Yeah, that's my I thing. Mean, they're now. already dead. Yeah, that's my I thing now, but I always felt like if you're going to eat it, you ought to know what that animal went through for it to make it to your plate. So. You know, I've hunted for a little while. I've got that out of my system. So, yeah, I've well, yeah, yeah, shot a, a bow since I was like four and a half years old, though. So it was just kind of like a natural progression. If you're gonna hunt and harm an animal, man, you should, like you know, people go fishing. Like I love to fish, and I catch and release unless I'm hunting. That's what I do too. Yeah, and um, then the, like catfish, you know, I'll, I'll get me a few catfish or something like that, but. As far as deer, man, you, it's people go out there and hunt just for the antlers or just to make a trophy <laughs> and just leave the rest of it out there, you know. And I don't believe in all that. No, I don't either. We try to utilize every bit of it. Yeah, last yeah. time I went hunting was in I was over in Michigan. And uh while well, we were Earlier, earlier in the day, we were hunting rabbits. We got to caught some rabbits. But that evening, we had to hunt a coyote that was uh, eating uh, his goats. So, yeah, we had we were up in uh, <coughs> past midnight. I don't know. I think we finally got him about 1 2 o'clock in the morning. Yeah, we finally got him. Coyotes are beautiful, too. Hey, Sandra, Sandra. Hey. Yeah, but it was a nuisance. It, was, it like killed like three goats. So Yeah, yeah it, was, it is. It's a problem. It costs you a lot of, it costs the farmer a lot of money. Yeah. I mean, but to go hunting, you got to have no heart, I mean, or love for animal. I mean, you might have love for animal for like for dogs and cats or something like that, but like, you know, food, you know, deer's food, cows are food, pigs are food, but they're still animals and I can't. I, I. I can't. If I'm gonna eat something like a chicken or, I. I can't see it getting killed in front of me. You got to I eat can't. it from the store, yeah. Yes. You're up. I, I just can't. I got a cousin that said that she don't eat chicken eggs. She only eats <coughs> eggs from the store. <laughs> you know what? I. I don't even remember if I had a um, chicken egg straight out of from the chicken. Oh yeah. There's a whole different level of egg. Yeah, yeah. That's great. That's how we get them all the time. That's I eat tons of eggs. We tried to raise them, but they they were kind of messy, so we gave them to someone else who likes to raise them. And we just buy the eggs from them. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, we got some. I got some friends that April works with, and he's always bringing her eggs. Why her eggs? Why not chickens? <laughs> <laughs> that's what I. Like. <laughs> Yeah, should, they might get in trouble for scrambling them eggs. I know. Yeah. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I've been home for work, but listen. K-Dog. Hey, K-Dog. Hey, K-Dog. Hey, Paranormal Witch, how you doing? Sandra, Sandra, how you doing? Robster, Midwest Adventure. Sandra talking about. And Sandra, Sandra, how you doing? They're just to talk about their cats. <laughs> <laughs> I never did. I didn't even see if. Uh... I mean, I I I like cats. I I grew up with having so many cats. Uh, my last house where I used to live at, man, we had tons of cats. <laughs> I mean, we had a lot of cats, and they were from all from all from one mother. And I'm like, damn, they're running all over the place. Yeah, I don't want no more cats. <laughs> so y'all pulled the pulled the cat's teeth. That's true, Johnny. This is. Hmm. We were just talking about Dennis a while ago, weren't we? 
Yeah, how sp- expensive they are, and why are yeah. why isn't uh, that part of your regular health insurance? Mm-hmm. They always tell you, you know, your your dental health is your your your. Did somebody say cats? Look at the kitty. Yeah, Adam. Yeah, it's hey guys, how are you? Good, good. When I said when uh, I said kitties, I, I was talking about Adam. I don't know who was that other guy. That well, was how do I? Excuse. <laughs> what did he go? Oh, you need to run him off. Yeah, I'm man. sorry, Adam. I'm sorry, man. Wow, buddy. Wow. Adam, come back. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I hate when I hit he that. He comes into class up to join with the run him off. I think they, I think they can't mind us. What does this do? <laughs> I love Adam. Adam's my boy, man. <laughs> He was in Vegas here a while back again. I think he goes a lot though. Oh man, he he went to a uh, Universal Studio. Yeah, I seen that. Well, video. I don't know if you guys saw the video, man. That is so cool. You know, man. man he, there he is. There he is. There I'm he so is. sorry. I pressed the wrong no, button. I'm sorry. I thought I offended you. I am so sorry because <laughs> you you know you're my guy, Adam. You're my guy. Nothing offends me. You know that. <laughs> Yeah, I was just telling him about your video that uh the the universal one was it? Oh yeah. Yeah man, that's that's cool, man. I only went you know, to one in Florida. The the video I posted, it's missing a lot of the really good parts of the tour because they're getting it ready for their big 60th anniversary. So they're redoing mm. the bunch. But yeah, it was still a lot of fun. Um I love the Norman Bates motel and stuff, like they call that yeah. away. Man, and they, uh, they have they, they have a ride that I want to be on. I think it's Fast and the Furious. Right? I think you showed it on your video too. Yeah, yeah. yeah I want to get on that one. Yeah, they're building. Maddie, you got to be about that tall, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there, there's a height. There's a maximum height requirement. Really? <laughs> no. I mean, <laughs> I'm only four eight, so. <laughs> well, you, you look tall. I was standing there on the go. box. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Melissa. Thanks. Hey, Patrick. Hey, uh, I don't know if I'm pronouncing Is his name her? How do you pronounce it? It's German. Her, her, her. 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 Face, I'm not 5'2". I told you I'm 14 and 19 tall. I'm <laughs> from Germany. Uh, from Germany, y'all. Uh, he's a good guy. Uh, great supporter. Okay. April. Yeah, I've seen him in several streams. He's 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 good. Hi, April. Hey, girl. Hey. So, what are you guys April, doing? What's, going on? What's new? What's happening? Uh, we're just getting our teeth clean. Oh, I missed my cleaning. It was a few weeks ago. Oh, okay, wow. Adam. As you said that, do you get your teeth cleaned? Did they clean your whole mouth? The whole mouth. Yeah, in one day. Um, yeah. Is that a uh, trick question? Day? My son went to the dentist and he was supposed to be a free cleaning. They cleaned half his mouth, charged him two hundred and eighty dollars. Then told him that his free cleanings was up because I think it's like two a year. And he wanted him to come back and pay eight hundred some dollars for Jeez. to clean the other half his mouth. Just for a cleaning? Insane. That's yeah. crazy. Listen, you know, I sometimes because I move so much, I'd be I finding get, another dentist. I oh, get things in the mail all the time, and it's for free cleanings with an appointment, and you don't have to pay anything. So I've used those many times, and okay, okay. it's just free. So I can't imagine them charging that much. But do they? All right, or find a, but do, uh, they, uh, uh, do your whole mouth at one in one day, or do they do yeah, sessions? Just a cleaning. Oh, yeah. It takes like twenty minutes. Uh-huh. 30 minutes. Yeah, I've never, I've never heard. I mean, all my life, it's always been, you know, you go to the dentist, get your mouth clean and out. <laughs> now, know, whether go to uh, the local university where they had the dental classes and stuff like that, you get a free cleaning there too. <laughs> yeah, even a deep cleaning is only like an hour. I mean, I think so. I don't but, know. But they told me they uh, they were going to do a deep cleaning. I'm not going to spend all that money anyway. But I told them I'm not, I'm not doing it. But they said. One half, 
one day and then next week come in and do the other half. Hmm. I guess it just depends, you know, on the situation. It's always different. So that don't seem like it ever takes that long, really. Shouldn't. I mean, unless they're doing actual work, you know, like cavities or something. That's the only reason. Right. Yeah, I'd drop your links, please. Every time I go to the dentist, they got to pull the teeth. I already got three missing. I'm waiting for one to come back. <laughs> it's, yeah. it's not pronounced her. It's pronounced hair. <laughs> From the shop. Yeah, hair. It's hair. true. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a bad mechanic <laughs> work, dude. <laughs> it's true. No, it's true. They gotta. They make. They're making me a tooth for this one. I've been missing. Oh, really? And they're gonna bring it to let me know when it's done. So are they gonna put like a screw or something on it? I have a screw sticking out. It's. Oh man. I've had it for like two or two and a half years because I've, you know, because of the stuff going on, and I never got right. it fixed. But, so yeah. I need to improve my image for YouTube. I will go get me a gold grill or something. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> yeah. You. I think they. I think I saw them at Five Below yesterday. Do you guys know Five Below? <laughs> yeah. Do you guys yeah, we do. Yeah. Oh, we do. Well, I just. I the just. Five Below and up. Yeah. Go yeah they're really not Five Below funny. anymore. They're Five Below and up. Yeah, That's Five true. Below and up. <laughs> That's how the Dollar Tree is now. Now the Dollar Tree is ten dollars. I don't know how that work, worked out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hey, did you hear they're gonna close down a lot of those Dollar Trees. They better not what? close. Them. Yeah, they're, t they're talking about closing down a lot of Dollar Trees stores. Mm -hmm. I told them the other. I told them one day they needed to change the sign to a Dollar Tree to a Dollar Twenty Five Tree. Mm -hmm. That's true. <laughs> I don't know why they, they stopped at a dollar. You know, twenty five. They could have just went to Dollar Fifty and, and call it a Dollar Fifty Tree. It ruined their brand. <laughs> And now you go in there and, and they get stuff for five dollars, so it ain't really a dollar tree. Yeah, no. five dollar no holla tree. <laughs> but you know what? They they have some good stuff at mine. Like when I was young, that's the only place I could shop, and you know they just had stuff. But now they have like stuff, stuff like good. They, stuff. they got some good stuff. They do. They they got some good like uh, plates. Yeah, Gosh. there's there's silverware in their plates. They're like, and, so and the and the candies you buy at the stores is like two dollars. Mm -hmm. You can buy them there for a dollar. I mean, come on. Just the candy alone is worth it. Hey, Joy. Yeah. Joy. Last night I was or, or today this morning I woke up. I went over to her live, and I said something about <coughs> support Joy and uh, Joy X. <laughs> I wrote her name twice, so Joy and Julie. Julie. Let's get double. Wait, so remind me again. Sean, you got monetized. No, not yet. Not I'm close. Yet. I'm uh, close. about 800 away now. I think 800, 800 hours away. Is it baddie? No, I haven't got monetized yet. I mean, I hit my, my, my thousand. Yeah, I'm uh, over 1K. Oh, that's right. yeah, you I'm got your thousand, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Both me and Bad Rick and Pretty much that's the same what, day. You know what? That's like the hardest part, I think. That's, yeah. that's for me, that was the hardest. Um, my hours, that's crazy. Um, we need you to go into your local Walmart and buy like 25 computers and play <laughs> all of our videos at one time. <laughs> oh, well, yeah. that's what I so when I work at the hotel, I have two computers at the front desk. And so if people ask, I'll just I'll just turn those on and oh, I shouldn't say that, right? <laughs> you gotta get caught up. <laughs> you caught up, Adam. But yeah, I guess it helps. I'm going to 9.99, then I'm stopping. <laughs> retire. Yeah, I'm gonna retire. Um, How many times I retired on the uh... Patrick? Patrick Paranormal hit a thousand today. Yes, sir. Oh, congrats, Patrick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like it's hard. I get it. Like, I thought when I was going to get monetized, I don't know what I thought was going to happen, you guys. I thought something was going to happen, some something magical. A parade. I'm still, waiting. <laughs> I'm still waiting. I got my second payment in over a year and a half, like a year and what? Four months? Uh -huh. Is Julie in here? I'm just like, well, I can't live on this. I guess I'll have to keep my job. Right. 
So where are you at, subscribers, uh, ET? What? Uh, I'm just now getting ready to hit 500. That's great. That's great because I think the first 500 are the hardest to get. That's what yeah. I I'm not real smart. I haven't even got my first 500 and already starting another channel. So there you go. Well, you're, so you face, might, you face might like to ace, you never know. Face to ace teases me that my name is Everyday Treasures Paranormal because Everyday Treasures don't sound like anything paranormal. So, <laughs> so, so in lieu of those comments, I started another channel. Okay. Thanks, Face to Ace. For <laughs> well, I'd rather find some treasures while I'm like paranormal <laughs> investigating. That's all Every day. Out. I'd rather find treasure than ghosts. Yes. But it started out, it started out, you know, everybody goes through treasure. life ignoring everything around them, you know. It's mm -hmm. like slow down, smell the roses a little bit. Enjoy the things that you have around you. Mm -hmm. But I, I live in the woods, so. though. You have to be, you know, I see a lot of people that pin a link to their stream up top. Do you got to be monetized to do that? Which one? Like, people will put a link, they'll pin a link up so people will click on it and subscribe to them. Oh, and like I, in the chat and stuff. Yeah, that's you, the YouTube app. I that's you think I gotta do do that. I know you have to have so many yeah. subscribers to do that. Yeah, yeah. I think it's five hundred, but I'm not sure. Uh, to do what? To pin a comment in your chat. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. I don't know. I never used it yet. I haven't tried it. <laughs> Julie's here. I think Julie's here. Oh, she is. Thank you, Hair. Appreciate you. Yeah, we I, we can we was I was told her her and Sean said something else and he finally told us to quit. Yeah, it's hair. Oh, call me Hair. <laughs> oh. So that's why yeah. I, I would change my name. Yeah. You can just call so, me I mean, Hair. My hair, <laughs> you, hair. Believe it or not, ET, my hair was way longer than that. Man, oh, what? mine's not very thick anymore. It used to be super thick. I could smuggle babies in it, but <laughs> now that I'm old, not so much. I used to take and brush it down. It was blonde, real blonde, and I'd brush it down, and I'd put my shades on and put a thing in my mouth, and I look like cousin it. Look <laughs> like Axl Rose. I love it. Yeah, if you guys speaking cool. to Axl Rose, have you guys heard that guy sing? Now that he's old. Oh man, I, not recently. I don't know. Guns N' Roses was my one of my favorite bands growing up. You know, in the 80s. oh man, it's em, it's and embarrassing. Now, now. It's embarrassing, yeah. It's almost like uh, I'm not going. I won't get political. It's like seeing some other people on TV, you know, <laughs> giving yeah, speeches. Yeah. It's he horrible. He's had so many <laughs> throat surgeries, and I, I'm surprised he can even talk today. But he even starting to look like a clown. Now, I guarantee you, every one of us could sing better than him. Not me. Heck is that? Just suddenly close that target. Oh man! Oh my gosh! Get out of here! I'm, no, it's not mm. fake. Somebody faked it. That's out. It. They can't be so nice. What's going on with Target? It was, it was, it's also <laughs> not uh, the uh, demonic and everything. Yeah, See right. How, look at the shirt and everything. <laughs> devil worshiping. Oh, yeah, they, they promote a lot of devil worshiping there. Target. Target does. Target. Target. Hey, Julie. Hey, Julie. Hey, Julie. How are you doing? Julie. Where's Amy at? She afraid of this live? She's a uh, working. They don't have a uh, signal. She's a workaholic right now. Yeah, they're Target. working all the time. Put Amy. You better get out there and clean this truck. <laughs> Taco, and they, they went to a different whale. And That's gonna make yeah. me hungry. One moment, Taco, one moment. <laughs> and I know yeah. this bummed Amy up because she hates missing a live or doing a live, or she hates. Oh, it. She just hates it when I'm up here. That's all, because she knows that I always talk crap about it. That's it's funny. True. Did you say she's somewhere where she doesn't have signal today? Is that what you said? Anybody yeah. knows this this fella here up here? Um, Midwest Adventures. 
I mean, yeah. I don't know if y'all uh, click on him and uh, let me check uh, what's going on. Just pick him, Rob. We all know who you are. <laughs> yeah, who's that Midwest Adventures? Yeah, he controls the whole West Coast, right? You got to check in with Midwest Adventures if you want to film out on this side in town. <laughs> well, he put that video up and he said, you know, and I was like, I'm not watching that video, man, because if he's quitting YouTube, I don't want to watch it. I uh, know it's not the same way. I even, I was like, what's going on with this? Because I've seen him a few times and didn't look Did at the picture. I didn't know we would. <laughs> <clears throat> I know it was a clip bait. I sat down with my box of tissues just in case. Uh -oh. Adam, got Adam, Adam thinking about Taco Lady. Taco Lady? No, no, no. Taco Lady. No, what? thanks. Thanks, Hair. Hair Sick Big. Taco Lady. Hey, so are, are any of you guys going to see the eclipse where you're living? Is it going by your house? Uh, well, that's me. creepy. I was just getting ready to bring that up. Yeah, oh, so you I'll put on CET. Oh. I hope you do. I'll have to get out my tissues again. Wait, so where do you live? I'm in Indiana, oh, Brown okay. County. It's supposed to go like right over the house. They did. They put out some kind of map today. We live in like a private lake area. It's a huge lake. And they, they've got their own little website and stuff, and they put out some literature about that. Like, the thing's going to go directly over our house. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> that's so convenient, too, because so many people are going out of their way just to see it, and you don't even have to leave. That's great. Right. Or charge, charge, charge rent for a while. You should. Right? You should open up a little. Uh, that's how it was on the last one. I just went to my friend's house in Idaho because I live in Utah. And it was just, you know, hanging out in the yard. So that yeah, was makes, really nice. it, makes it nice. I don't know why they're not promoting it more. They've got a private beach and the whole nine, man. I mean, I big. Well, I'm going to Buffalo, New York. So <laughs> that, Buffalo. that's going to be fun. Man, you, you travel a lot. I like wow. that. Well, it's almost like I have a travel channel, Batty. Just kidding. Come on. <laughs> I, well, I, gotta, you mean, I gotta travel. You are like you are like the main travel channel. No. I think I just, should, uh, all the places he visits, I think he should buy and box, you know, get them boxes with the ice in it and then mail us out some of that food he eats all the time. That's what I was gonna do for Patreon, actually. I was gonna start sending uh, send me little bottles of the drink that you keep drinking, dude. Which one? <laughs> all of them. Oh, I don't care. Man, <laughs> no. It's all of them, man. <laughs> well, that reminds me of Universal Studios. Like the other day when I went, I had a bunch of mini bottles in my bag. <laughs> and I forgot. Yeah. Oh, they man. didn't let me bring those <laughs> in. <laughs> I remember in Vegas, we saw oh, see that going on. And Adam said, "Anybody want a drink?" And he pulled out this big old bottle of something. <laughs> Like, get away, man. We had to pull the police, but I forgot we was in Vegas. <laughs> yeah, first, you can drink anywhere in Vegas. That's fine. The first video I saw of Adam, he was on a cruise ship, and he was the whole time he always had a drink in his hand. That's well, yeah, because that's when they're free. You just keep drinking them. And you lost that's count. You were saying, This is my uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. That was like a few Christmases ago. That's funny. Yeah. I'm gonna go back on it. Oh cruise. man, dude. That was that was a cool cruise ship though. I mean that was really nice, except for two people died on the cruise. Really <laughs> no cool. freaking way. You serious? Yes. That's like and, while you were there. Amy said there's a corner there for you, ET. No yeah. What? <laughs> what happened? What did you just say? Cruise and somebody passed away on it. Oh, really? That's yeah, because old people go on cruises. That made true. everybody go to the rooms so they can bring them out. A lot more people die on a cruise than you think. I well, take a spirit box. I know. Would that be rude? No. <laughs> it's like you see somebody fall over, you run over and say, wait, let me talk to him. <laughs> I mean, when you take it out and you turn it out and say, I'm trying to get the, the frequency here, right? Uh, the AM, <laughs> FM radio or something. Just pretend, you know? You don't have to tell them it's a spirit box. Mm-hmm. That's part of the fun. <laughs> that is. Well, 
I think. Uh, <laughs> oh, have any of you been to cruise ship jail? Because I have. That was. <laughs> I've never been on a cruise ship, so I can't say. I've been cruise, cruise ship jail. jail? Yes. Well, Wait, you know you're bad. Is, is, is that a is that a thing? Really? Yeah. You got kicked out of the state of Wisconsin. Does that count? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> out of my whole state. I never, never heard of that. I got kicked out of Brown County and was told never to come back, but I've not made it to the state level yet, Sean. I mean, are you that. serious? That's what happens oh when God. you're messing around in a state park and you get the state cops on you, and the state cops ask you to the border. <laughs> oh, there's a gun. If you got onto a cruise, you was on like his uh, cruise was like his own little private country. I mean, they, they can arrest you. They can do what they want to you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> International waters. You never yeah, know. Yeah. And then you get, awesome. you get robbed by pirates. You know, I haven't had that yet, but I'll put it on my list. If it happens, I'll let you know. You get There's real live pirates out there. Oh, I've got so many jokes right now, Batty. Don't get me in trouble. No, don't even do that. <laughs> <laughs> Have you guys seen uh what was that movie um uh, with Tom Hanks? Uh, yeah, Castaway. Captain Phillip, no Captain oh. Captain Phillips, something like that. Yeah, there was a part. There was a part, and my wife hates it. You know, I don't like those kind of movies. To be honest, I like action movies, yeah. horror movies, all that stuff. So there yeah. was a part when they the pirates had um Tom Cruise tied up in that little whatever little boat they had like this, right? They had him blindfolded. It's supposed to be a serious scene. And then uh, there was some guy, a sniper on the boat, ready to snipe the pirate out. So when he shot the pirate, killed him, Tom Cruise was like this. He goes, what's happening? Yeah. To me, for some reason, I bust out laughing oh. loud in the theater. And my wife got so red and so mad. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, it, it's supposed to be a serious movie, and... It just came out to be funny to me. I didn't uh, think about that. It, it just okay. I was I always consider Tom Hank a, a, a <laughs> comedy guy as well because you know that's what he started off as a, co a comedian. Yeah, he's but, getting in his old age. He's getting more serious. Yeah, no, he's a great actor, man. I, I like Tom Hank. Do you know that the one of the the lead uh, like Forrest Gump? That's a good. Hijack, hijacker in that movie. Um, was you remember back in the 80s when they had to feed the children commercials on and they would show that little African boy and telling you to feed it? That's him. Really? I didn't really? know. That. I don't know. Hmm. That's crazy. I watched yeah. that movie on a cruise. How does that? How does that sound? I did. Uh, which that one, Cap Captain, Captain Philip? Yeah. <laughs> so when I was paranoid, <laughs> it's like watching a freaking uh, air, airline uh, disaster movie on an air. On a, on a, <laughs> That's why I never watched them. I, I don't watch those while I'm thinking flying. No way. I don't watch those kind of movies. We want to hear more about cruise jail, San Antonio, and I said, no, oh, yeah. no, I put cruise jail." Oh, I can't tell you guys. I was just oh, story time. No, there's, there's nothing to tell. Okay, I'll tell you. So um, when I went to my first cruise to Alaska, right before the, you know, everything closed, uh, I started drinking because that's what you do on a cruise. And then I guess the sun doesn't set in the summer in Alaska. So I just kept drinking and drinking. And then my husband was looking for me and I kept going to people's rooms to drink more. And then finally, I just like blacked out and I was in a hot tub with just random people. <laughs> um, and uh, my clothes were missing. I don't know where they were. <laughs> and then I was looking and um, it turns out it was like 4.30 or 5 in the morning. And I thought it was only like 1 or something. <laughs> so listen, they had to stop the ship. They had to do a like a man overboard drill. They had to wake the captain up. Like I'm not even kidding because Barney put no out like a missing person bulletin on the ship because uh, I was missing. <sighs> so hold on, they were looking for you. Yes, they were trying oh, to find yeah. his clothes. 
They see they seen his clothes floating on the water, so he thought they jumped overboard. That's what it does. So stupid. You know what I get from that story though? That the way you know how to quit drinking is when the sun goes down. Yeah. How, does, how does that work? No, I I was thinking that it was much earlier, is what I'm saying. Like I thought uh, it was one o'clock in the morning, but it was almost five. And so my husband had been searching for me for hours. Oh wow. Well, oh, he wow. thought that I was like jumped over. I don't know what he thought, but I, um, I was just <laughs> having like a heart to heart with some random stranger. I remember they were like crying, and I was like, It's gonna be okay, let's go get some more drinks. And then, wow. so anyway, long story short, I'm walking down the hall in a towel, and there's five these five little guys. I call them little because they were little, <laughs> and they had this paper like I was FBI, like most wanted my face was like on this big sheet of paper and they're like you and i was like what and like i got in a fight with i was like what do you want i'm not allowed to like, we've, been, we've been reported missing so anyway that's the ship's version of a milk carton yes yeah so anyway long story short they took me to jail there is a jail on the ship it's down down in the bottom um and this uh what was I going to say? This uh, So that was the first night of the cruise. <laughs> oh, <laughs> first night. And so for the next six days, they were just like on top of everything I did. And I didn't really do anything. It was just a miscommunication with, with Barney. And so we got in a huge fight. And it was a huge, obviously a huge deal. And then uh, so the whole cruise was kind of just like, you know, I was just like a mess. <laughs> so you went to you went to cruise jail and got grounded. So on that cruise, like on that cruise, I found out that there's lots of swingers on cruises too. And then I also saw someone's marriage like end, like bring a we pineapple. Were, it was really? wow. Yeah, it was such a huge. It was such a dramatic cruise, you guys. And um, yeah, but I'll never forget it. So yeah, you can get arrested on a cruise. Um, That's crazy. It's I mean, but you would think you were missing. And you showed up, you would think they would be happy that they found you instead of, you know, they don't think that you went overboard. Well, instead, they, they took both, you to jail. I, I made a lot of people have to get up and um, and search. and it's Especially like, the captain. But it wasn't yeah. your fault, though. That's the thing. It wasn't your fault. I know. And if it was, if it had been any other situation, I would have been removed off the ship. They were saying I for sure would have been taken off and I would have, I would have been wow. fine so, wow. but it's like you know me i'm not crazy i'm not that crazy but i was just kicked out of the shit for having a good time <laughs> like, i wasn't doing anything so right. but that's a horrible thing to do on the first night of a cruise because then you're mm -hmm. stuck on that for a week and so then all the workers just hated me the whole wow. time like well, what did i do <laughs> well, I, have a, I have a question for you, Adam. I mean, I don't have that many subscribers, so you can tell us the secret. Um, <laughs> you know, like, what, 15 drinks a day if you buy the pass? Oh, on the cruise? Yeah. Um, yeah, I usually get the unlimited package, and it's between 15 and 18 a day, I think. Okay. Wow, <laughs> that, that little bit, that little bit, I mean... You well, you just gotta know how to order it. So I always do. So if you get a bartender that's nice, you ask them for doubles, and they don't charge you for the one drink. Well, they charge you for one and give you two technically. Mm. So I've I I've reached my read. limit on the cruise before by like twelve. So like by noon. <laughs> so, <laughs> by noon. Like, really? Yeah. Let me tell you, I can do. I mean, not anymore. I could never, but. Back in the day, absolutely. Um, well, my question is, how do you smuggle alcohol onto the ship? The only way I've been able to do it, and I've done it many times, is you have to get the whitening kind of mouthwash, not the clear bottle. Yeah. And you have to, um, because if you use a regular bottle of mouthwash, no matter what you put in and how much you've cleaned that bottle, it's going to ruin the alcohol in it and you're going to just taste mint. So you have to do the whitening one. And then I think I used to take a hair dryer and I would heat the plastic and then pull it off and then 
put it back on after and then heat it again. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's how I would always bring it on. But I've just found that it's not even worth the stress anymore. Uh, everybody that's going on a cruise is running to the store, getting mouthwashes and putting them in big pot like baby bottles and boiling them now. <laughs> oh, really? Wow. No, I just, I don't know. I don't really drink much anymore, so I don't even. I don't need dare to drink. Yeah, I've seen some videos on the people doing all kinds of things and trying to get booze on board uh, things, taking, you know, 12 packs of uh, soda or whatever like that, open them up and pack, you know, put put beer in there, just have a couple cans by the handle holes where you can see in there. You, know, you have a couple cans of soda right there. So when they, they look inside that little hole, you see soda, but all the rest of the cans are beer. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's cool. out of here, so many, I think, sodas or I think you carry what? Two bottles of wine. You can bring two bottles of wine and two 12 packs, I think, with you on per person. Oh, really? No, per, per cabin, sorry. I didn't know they let you. Uh, yeah, the only thing I snuck in is candy in the theater or popcorn. Yeah. I would go in and pull on like Whopper and fries, and like I would just have the whole thing under my arm. Really? Yeah. You got to have gonna it. Do that. I'm going to do that too, man. You got to have I'm gonna a go, I'm going to go watch King Kong and Godzilla this month. I'm going to sneak in some McDonald's food or something. Do it. They don't care. They don't care. I promise. It's all good. <laughs> so you're going to get one of them girls in there to usher him out of the building. Yeah, don't listen to anything I say. I've never like... Yeah, I'm, going to, to I'm going to say, look, I knew I knew this guy. His name is Adam. He told me to do this. If you want to see him, you have to come to one of my lives. <laughs> That and was his have fault. To subscribe first. <laughs> we can take your take his picture with you. They might recognize. <laughs> I'll I, I show I show him the the YouTube channel. And before you talk to him, you got to subscribe to him. Right. I'm just getting people arrested left and right today. <laughs> just be careful. Just I've never you know I'm no scientist or anything. I, I don't know. <laughs> I know you would think I was, but uh, one, but I'm definitely not. Um, so yeah. Anyhow, what are you talking about Rob? What did I call them? I didn't call them anything. I didn't even mention their name. What happened? Uh, Rob said you should stop. Uh, <coughs> let's see what it said. Bad kid, you shouldn't call Amy April names like that. What? The hey, you guys. <laughs> hey, hey, listen. Don't get him upset. I live in the Midwest. He could get to me. <laughs> Experienced. That's one word. That's one word for it. Um, I do get around. <laughs> so. I tell you what, man. I wish I could travel just like you. You know what? I tell people all the time. The only reason I can is because I work for a big hotel chain. And uh, I get a lot of free rooms at places. And I have my husband works, he travels every month for work. And so I will just hop on one of his work trips. So if ever you see me somewhere, it's not because I'm like paying to go. Right. So, like, if I had to pay for those all, no, there's no way I could. But so that's why I'm just like taking advantage of it while I can because mm -hmm. we don't know how long he'll travel like that. But yeah, that's all I do. So it's really cheap that way, of course. And my cat just farted on me. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Didn't even Sad. warn me. Didn't even get a little. Hurt. He was just a, he was he was just jealous that you went on with some cool cats instead All of all right. <laughs> About to run me straight off the camera. <laughs> I've never had to have never had a cat do that before. So I guess me I'm neither. Lucky. I guess I'm lucky. <laughs> I had tons of cats. I and I'm talking about a lot of cats. I think any more than three cats and you're a cat lady. Is that how it works? That might be. Because I, I have three. three and that's it. <laughs> now we've got one and she doesn't allow any others, so mm. I have never had little cats. I'd get a cat when I was a kid and it would run off. Oh. Well, yeah. uh, this cat's pretty cool. She's not one of those cats always rubbing on you, constantly needing attention, and 
I mean, half the time she'll grump at you as a, you know, she likes to come and sit with you and chill and hang out with you, but she don't need to be messed with all the time. So mm. she's a keeper. That's good. Yeah. Yeah. My one cat's like a hundred years old and then the other two are just barely two. And so they attack her every oh. day, every second. They're always after her. So I have to separate them. It's not the younger ones are how old too? Two. Yeah. They're the cutest ever, but they're just little nightmares. The oldest is a hunt. No, I mean, I don't think cat. Like in cat years, years, she's like almost a hunt. She's like 14. So oh, is there really a cat year? I know in dog years, it's seven years, yeah. right? One year, seven years. Dog years, is, isn't dog years four? And cats are seven? I don't know. I think cats are seven. Um, and we have a little tiny dog that's like that. He's about, I think he's about 15 years old. We thought we lost him last night. He had, I guess he has seizures or something. He screams at night. Oh, no. He got us all up at about 3, 30, 4 o'clock in the morning. Thought we was losing him. But but he's only four inches tall and his name's Harley. And he <laughs> thinks he's a big, like, giant dog. We had a we had a doodle. And that doodle got so tired of this guy's axe that he grabbed him and picked him up, had him in the air. And we had to make him put him down. This dog's super sweet, too, man. He had him up in the air. Trying to yeah. hurt him, we made him put him down. As soon as the little dog hit the ground, he was right back on the big dog again. Oh, he has seven tags. I said dog years, dog years are seven years, and cat years are seven years oh, too. Seven years. Oh, okay, cool. Good to know. Yeah, I didn't know that. Okay. Yeah. So, do you guys all get on this panel on your phones, or do you do it through the PC? I I got mine's on the PC right now. On PC, I don't ever I use too. a phone because I don't trust it. I don't know. I get nervous, but I, I normally am sitting still when I do it too, and not all over the house like I'm doing tonight. So, I'm trying to stay out of people's way. Well, I'm not used to doing it, so I'm doing it on my phone right now. I don't really have it set up to where the computer in a place where I can do that, unfortunately. Yeah. Well, you can always just use your phone, and then you just put like a little picture up like this, and that's what everyone else does, right? And then I just am a taco. <laughs> I was currently well, 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 give him a taco. Yeah. I'm folding laundry and talking. I'm multitasking. I know. I've been on my phone. I've done it on my phone uh, yeah, a few times. So, I mean, yeah, here too. Well, it's, just, it's just harder to read the chat. I did a live stream at the Queen Mary the other day. I don't know. I don't know if you guys were there or not, but I don't know what YouTube's done, but it, it was so weird. Like nothing worked and I couldn't see anyone's comments mm -hmm. the whole time. And I've never had any issues live streaming on a well, on the on that virtual virtual because a lot they got a lot of kinks in that virtual streaming right now. What's I uh, that? I don't even know. I, I I did lives on, on YouTube um a couple of weeks ago and None of my videos showed up on my my channel. Weird. But uh, Sean said that he went. He tried to get on my live, and it says private. I don't remember pressing anything said private. Yeah, I, think, I thought the stream ended already, and it just you know wasn't uh, uploaded or something from to YouTube yet. I I've been doing like mine's. Don't been do it, Florida. Oh, <laughs> sorry. No, that's fine. Uh, I was gonna say, you know how you can make a short out of like a normal video and like right. it's like a remix or something. Um, I've had a handful of those where they take them off and they try and demonetize. Well, they demonetize the video and then they give me a copyright thing, and I I don't even know what that's about. So <laughs> copyright your own video? <laughs> yeah, I don't understand. Yeah. They're like, you well, don't. Have what? Wait a minute! They gave you a copyright on your own video without yes. having any music. Without having any music from somebody else or logos or something? No, some of them had music, but I pay for <laughs> the music. I wonder, now that you're saying it, I'm saying it out loud, I wonder if it's because the music was from, like, Epidemic Sound and you have one license. So maybe if it's on two different videos on your channel, maybe, I don't know. I'll have to look into it. <laughs> I do. Uh, you get an email and saying your 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 video is claimed by the paranormal paranormal violation. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what it said. And I just can't with this. Like, I there's been so many weird things over the past just the past year that I've just given up trying to even know why it happened. So I just kind of, <laughs> I just kind of move wow. on. 
because I can't. That, make, that makes me wonder because I'm going to take some of the videos off of Everyday Treasures and drag them over to the new channel to No Fake and Ghosts. So hopefully I don't run into you that. As long as you don't have music that's uh, from a subscription service or anything, then you'll be okay. Um, yeah, had, uh... But you know what? Uh, the the music they have for YouTube, um, what's that? YouTube Studio, whatever that is. Uh, they don't go with some of the videos that I have. Yeah, yeah, no, that's what I did. I couldn't find music I wanted to use, so I had to go pay. And I, I hate that it's so expensive. It makes me crazy when I think about it because I don't use it enough. But it's like seventeen ninety nine a month <clears throat> to be able but to put copyright free music. Mm. So, um, oh, wow. But yeah, YouTube Music Studio, you should never have an issue with those uh, songs. People I have, I have used uh, YouTube Studio and used the music on it for some of my videos, and still, I mean, I was unmonetized, but really? I still got a thing from them saying I was using copyrighted music. But it comes from yeah, there, was one, there, was, was, there was one or two I had too, but th it goes away after a day or two, though. It, it, might, it might get copyrighted, but I know I, it. It went away because it was copyright. I, I even said to, uh, you know, I was like, "What the heck? This is I got this from the from the YouTube Studio or whatever." That's crazy. And that's when I got right. the email. I did get a message back saying it'll it'll go away in a day or so, and it did. Avatar One K, y'all gonna have a lot more of that stuff. If y'all get monetized. Oh, I can't remember some so much good music on the shorts. For some reason, the shorts they don't they don't like. They don't flag them the same. I don't know what it is. I was just going to ask you guys, too. Do you have really good views on your shorts? Because mine are ridiculous. And then I do a video, and I'll get, like, 11 views in a, a week. Or My, I, I, just, I posted a bunch of those ones of those guitars, and um, it just shows, you know, uh, autographed guitars from different celebrities. Mm -hmm. And they're all, they average about, you know, 400 to – one's got, like, almost 4,000 views on it. Well, but I only have, I've got less than 500 subs. I, mean, I don't think it really matters so much with shorts, but. AT, the yeah, video yeah, you did the other night, was it called virtual? What was that? That no. the live, that was that vertical. Vertical. Live. I, I was vertical called a virtual, but it's vertical, Melissa. I'm sorry. Yeah, see, and I only, I didn't have very many people show up to that because. I just did it impromptu. I just decided to do it because I don't do this stuff. So I just thought I'd do something outside my comfort zone, just throw myself out there. Yeah. And um, so, but I thought that it was like the shorts and they push it out like the shorts. And I guess they do if you have over a thousand subs. If you got less than a thousand subs, it's just like the regular, um, the regular live streams. Mm. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I can put like a short on YouTube and I'll get, a few views off of it, but then you go on TikTok and I'm like uh, 800, 900, you know. Gosh, if I had TikTok views on YouTube, I'd be rich right now. But, oh, yeah. <laughs> but TikTok's crazy. Yeah. Tick, it's so crazy the videos that they push over, uh, you know, it's just, I never will understand. I'll never get it. But well, try to enjoy it as soon as, uh, as much as you can because they're still trying to take it down. Oh, yeah, that's true. I think my last one had 1.6 million. Views. Wow. And, wow, that's a lot. And all I did was take a pic, like all I did was film my television because I was watching a movie and laughing at it. Like <laughs> that's all I did. And it was nothing to do with me or my channel, but it's like stupid stuff like that. Always. You know, you know, I, I've been on the TikTok, you know, TikTok live, you know, strolling, and I've seen people just like sleeping and try to play video game while they're sleeping. <laughs> and you got you got a bunch of people on their live. I'm yeah. like, really? I mean, you're watching this guy just sleeping, trying to play a video game, then sleeping, playing a uh, the It's the same character dying all the time, and he's just there sleeping. And you see all these people giving him roses, hearts, or whatnot. And I'm like, honestly, man, I should just stay on TikTok then. <laughs> Yeah. TikTok's a weird place. It's weird. I just barely started. I, I've i refused to use TikTok for anything until, like, over the holidays, I started looking at it because people kept telling me, you got to go on there if you want to have people come to YouTube. Like, it'll help. And I'm like, I don't think so. 
I mean, it really hasn't, but... Um, yeah, I was going to say, it doesn't help me, and I've been trying to promote my YouTube channel. I get a lot of views on some of the, the stuff I get on there, on TikTok, but, you know, yeah, I haven't got anybody from there, not that I know of. I guess I'm just going to make a new channel where I sleep, and people can just watch, <laughs> <laughs> because I don't yeah. ever sleep. So I'm just going to, you'll just see me like going like this at night on my bed, just going, why? Do a video. Debbie was asking, having insomnia. do you not ever sleep? Who? Debbie. She was asking, she said, I got up this morning, seen you did another live. I said, I was just trying to play my videos to get hours. Oh. But yeah, I went to bed at like 4, 4.30 this morning and was back up at 7. I think I do that every night. You do that every night? Just about. Oh, that's hard. I work graves, so that's why it's so hard for me to sleep at night. I work, you know, 10 p.m. to 7 a.m. So but look at this. Now I don't know how much time I got left on this earth. I'm going to enjoy every friggin' minute I can. <laughs> yeah, my grandpa I'm used to that exciting. I'm playing. I, I can never grow oh. my beard like that. My yeah. beard grows as far as this, like, like right here. That's just Mine's scraggly. You got a nice full beard, man. Mine's scraggly. That's why it's like a it's like a beard version of a comb over. I I started I had a good team a little beard of peach fuzz growing and then I went and looked in the mirror and it was all like gray already. I was like, no, and I shaved it off. I don't mind gray, man. Yeah, me either. Yeah, no, I fight it. I can't. Oh, yeah, when I you're 105 years old, I mean, 102 years old, you look 105, then you start worrying about it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's weird? Like, um, when my mom passed away this year, my hair That's just went that. like completely gray. Like, all of my hair is gray now. Like, you can see it from here. Yeah. Nerds, man, like, nerds. I've never had gray before like that. It's crazy. It's distinguishing. Well, thank you. That's what my wife tells me. I'm like, uh, just make me a little, like, you know, a year older or make me look older. <laughs> you need to quit hiding her glasses and she won't do that to you. <laughs> um, that's why I, that's why I wear them and I look in the mirror and I said, nope. She's trying to be so handsome. <laughs> if you ever meet somebody that has done a lot of time in prison, when they go No, in, we don't meet those kind of people, Slim. I'm just saying, if you see them, you know, like, like childhood friends and then you find out they go to prison and didn't get out. Two or three years later, their hair is plum white. Oh. Think about the presidents. Presidents, they go in the hair is dark when they come out, it's white because all the you know why is. you want you want to know why because all the crap they've seen. Look at all the airplane pilots, most of them white head. Like, look at this group of people you got around you. You think we meet prison people every day? <laughs> I know, right? Or presidents. <laughs> Well, I'm just going to tell everyone I'm a pilot now. That's great. That's a great idea. <laughs> I'm just saying stressful, like stressful jobs, stressful situations, man, turn you. Um, you can't you can't tell people you as a pilot, though. They might pull up your record on the boat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't have a record, though. That's good. Yeah, but, that is good. Uh, I got lucky. Uh, I got a record. Well, that's yeah, hey, yeah. you know what? That's totally fine. I just I it's a different, like different environments, man. I mean, it was it was not. Oh, I guess it was choice. I mean, I had a choice, but in the situation where I was lived, there was a certain way you lived, and you know, you end up getting in trouble and hanging out with the wrong people. <laughs> all you know, so I had to finally, when I got older, I realized that these ain't good people for me, so I had to separate from them. Yep. Because it wasn't really I did. I mean, I did, but it was most of it because of them. You know what I mean? Yeah. Right. That's how it was where I grew up and went to high school. It was a rough town, a rough little town. It still is. It's gotten worse, but I had to just move out because I kept getting in trouble too. So, yeah, I get it. I ain't proud of it, but it's just, you know, it's part of my life. I had to deal with it. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> We probably all got a bit of a past, I guess. Ooh, shady past. Yeah, absolutely. 
I'm an open book too. Like I have no yeah. problem talking about my it. past. And <laughs> yeah, I think I was just talking about this on a, on a stream the other day. I think I was glad when there there was absolutely no cameras and stuff when I was growing up because that would be oh, too yeah. much incriminating. incriminating Man, we, we'd have broke YouTube. <laughs> Everything that we did in the course of a week, most YouTubers film in their whole life. <laughs> just, just imagine if YouTube was around back then. Others, oh, it wouldn't make it. Like <laughs> we, we, we'd be all in prison. <laughs> <laughs> we'd be first and cops. Yeah, yeah, because we were doing all this exploring and ghost hunting and all that stuff, man. Before it was even cool to film it, you ain't gonna carry one of big old VHS. I mean, wait a minute, one of them small new digital recorders with you. <laughs> big old, you just gonna say big old VHS recorder. <laughs> you got a big old boom box. Or your, one, on one, your 110 uh, film camera. That's right. We got a big boom box on one arm, and then we got the big old VHS recorder on the other one. Yeah. Look, how many of y'all, when you was kids, though, you know, you walked around looking for a pay phone to make a phone call when you was you know, out, and you was like, one day, man, we're gonna have these phones that we can carry around with us, and then. That's the wrong. Actually thought about man, I wish I had a video camera to record yeah. and stuff, you know, and post it somewhere where we could make a bunch of money. Now look at us. Yeah. And now we got these little de- now you got little devices you could talk to every one of your friends at one time, show them what you're doing and record it all at the same time. All in the same place. I then miss I miss stuff. you it will break you from being shy. Mm. If you hang, just hang out with a little bit. That's true. Would you say Adam? No, I just say I miss phone calls. I don't even have phone calls anymore um, with my friends. We don't we don't talk on the phone. We haven't in years because we have stupid messenger and we just put it in a group chat. And so I only have like two people in my life I even call. And so it's nice when I get to just sit around and chat on the phone because you know you just you don't think about all the stuff we don't do anymore because of. Yeah, Remember the hundred foot cords on your phone that you yes. took all the way outside and thought stretch them out to where the little <laughs> curls go backwards and they don't stretch back anymore. Yeah, and all the phone numbers you're yeah. able to remember in your head, the ten my digit phone numbers. <laughs> well, my step them all. If you stretch that, remember my own. <laughs> little phone and had a little cord, so and if you left it there and you stretched it over, this should come over and pop you on the head. Don't be stretch <laughs> that. Yep. Or the per- uh, the first cell phones looked like they were in a suitcase. Yeah. The brick phones. The brick phones. Freaking they used to be like the first cellular phones, those brick phones like this with yeah, my, a little my longer. Brick phones. I'm I'm like really thankful that we didn't grow up with that. Honestly, I I'm thankful that I didn't grow up with any technology really. I mean oh man barely. Internet started when I graduated high school, but we didn't have internet, you know, yeah. it wasn't a thing. I didn't have a phone until I was a grown adult. So it's kind of nice to well, have all Computer those. screens were green at yeah. the time. They yep. weren't this colorful. Right. You used to have to type commands in for everything in the yeah. dock. <laughs> oh, gosh. And then you had like floppy disk instead yeah. of those SD cards. You had these big square floppy disk thing mm-hmm. they put in that yeah, kind of takes board. me back to the conversation we had earlier about hunting and when we was kids man we would get out in the field and chase we could chase rabbits down get a couple guys together you could chase rabbits down and catch them by hand right. let somebody try to do that right now <laughs> <laughs> is that something on minecraft <laughs> <laughs> my thing was remember you had atari's right and you had that game where you hit the little ball and bounce and then they came oh. out with the first computers oh, yeah. Big game on there, and everybody was wanting a computer just to play that game. And you had it mm. on Atari. <laughs> yeah, <family>. yeah. <laughs> oh man, good old days. And yeah, we had a TRS, one of those TRS eighties, and you had to program a lot of your own games into it to even play the game. You had to know how to program at first before you could ever play it. That's kind of cool. Mm. I didn't have like video games when I like that when I was a kid. I had to go to my neighbors and play on theirs. <laughs> Well, yeah, a buddy of mine used to do DOS, man, and he was crazy on that stuff. Like Zelda was coming out when DOS was still out, and uh, I mean, he ended up running Kiss Nation, so he does their their fan thing for Kiss Nation. Wow, 
Wow. Yes, yeah, sucks. I was supposed to meet Gene Simmons with him twice. He's got one of his ex guitars, and two times I was going to meet, hang out like you would in the living room with Gene Simmons, and something come up and I couldn't do it because no. I had to go to one of my sister's weddings, and they were just like down the street from us. Yeah, I remember that, Rob. Uh, VCR. I still, have, I, still, I still have a VCR. Well, I have one of those VCR DVD player, VCR and DVD player. Yeah. yeah. I still have that. It's still working. I want to go get a VCR, actually. That kind of sounds fun, because I want to start. I hear all the thing is people are collecting uh, VHS again. Yeah. And I, got a, just, I, I got a bunch of uh, VCR uh, tapes. It's like vinyl. Vinyl, yeah. came, vinyl was coming back, too. So, yeah, it's not, mm -hmm. not, not surprising that VHS will come back, too. Everything, RCA. everything comes in a circle, you know, goes in a circle. So. Except RCA. now you can take the vinyl record players and hook them to the computer now. Yeah. 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 Or you don't even have to hook up any wires. It's all Bluetooth. You just have your, have your Bluetooth uh, record player. I love my record player. I, I use it all the time. I always have. I think it's. The kids cool. say now, uh, why are y'all keeping them VCR tapes? Throw them away. They, you don't, they don't even make VCRs no more. I said, yeah, they didn't make record players no more now, but we're sitting here listening to a record on a record player here in 2024. Shoot, man, if we had half that stuff we had growing up, we could retire. We wouldn't have to worry about any of this. I just want to start buying DVDs again, I think, because I've been watching a lot of channels. They've been popping wow. up on the feed. All right, what's going on with that? They're oh, talking yeah. about like buying DVDs now. Awesome, man. That's awesome. I didn't even like my own video. What happened? <laughs> oh, wow, you got 460 likes. And I, I never liked my video. Wow. Thank y'all, man. Is that a thing, putting a like on your own videos? Sure. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes, sometimes, like, if I do I a video, yourself, you know, if you're, if you're running for president, you're going to vote for yourself. I, <laughs> then it's, I don't know, for some reason, it throws it out there, and then all of a sudden I started getting, like, views. I did see something sarcastic by YouTube about you should be liking your own video. And I, I, it's like, I don't really see the point in it. I mean, I know it's mine. I filmed it. I don't really like it right now because I had to edit it. I had to <laughs> wait for that thing to upload for like 15 hours. I don't really like it right now. But that's another thing. Me and Sean was talking about it when Sean was right before he hit 1K. Uh, you know, YouTube wants you to do all of this stuff to get to that 1K. But then they'll start playing ads on your videos before you hit one day. Yeah. I found, I I found one of my videos had ads in it, and I didn't even hit uh, 900 at the time. I would say like, something I think is really dumb, man, is that vertical live. You use that vertical live because it goes out like shorts, and you get just tons and tons and tons right. of followers or subscribers. Yeah. But they oh, don't really? let you use it. You don't. They don't let you use it until you get a thousand subs. It's like, why don't you let me have it five hundred subs, and I'll be to a thousand subs in a couple weeks. Well, that's Wait, like, so vertical lives make you more views than a regular live. Is yeah, you get a lot of views well, you, or a YouTube, lot of subs from it. If you have your your phone vertical and you you having YouTube live, it, it, you get a lot of viewers coming in. It's just like a lot. Uh, they send out. Oh, they send it okay. out. It's well, just like a short. I'm gonna need yeah. to do that. Not, I'm gonna I, know. I mean, StreamYard could yeah. get you where you know, for the regular people. Mm -hmm. But uh, the YouTube Live, if you have it vertical, it goes straight out to everybody. Well, shoot, what have I been doing? I've not even tried. I've, I think you know what? I think I did try to do it at the Queen Mary, but it wouldn't let me. It made me switch okay. it back over to. Well, that's what that day. Yeah, yeah. I know you got to go into your advanced settings when you when you're setting up I, the live. Yeah. I do and know I that. And yeah, I, I gotta I make sure that. it's all vertical and keep the phone vertical too. And if you switch it, I guess if you, it messes oh, things great. up. Hey, Amy, oh, can't hear us. Everybody, hey, start talking. Hold on, wait a minute. You know, Hi, this Amy, live was going know. great. This live was going great until Amy <laughs> walked in. Hey, hey Slim, uh, you got all great. the good scoops. All right, I'll be right back. Sean got scared. Turned his camera off. You can turn it back on and laugh. You know what? I'm no, trying to right put back. Sean go to get something. the Golden Shovel <laughs> Award. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to get him a Golden Shovel Award so he could be happy. He's always telling me, man, Bad Rican, I don't have a Golden Shovel award. He needs a Golden need Snow one. Shovel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to subscribe. Well, maybe not. I think I send you the video, so I will, I will subscribe to you. Yeah. I have, like, next... what? Yeah, all y'all 
all y'all before I even started YouTube, y'all had me like at 190 subscribers, and I didn't have the first video. Wow, <laughs> that's really good. That's that's, really good. that's awesome. That's that's about the far as it went for a while there. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, my goal is trying to hit 2,000 subscribers now. I've been going around to the neighbors trying to pay them to get subs. <laughs> <laughs> I went to pick up some stuff from the auction today, and the two guys was in there. I was like, we'll sub to you. I'm like, all right. I'm like, well, here's a I was, dollar bill. I was just trying to get to 400 because at 400, that's when you can like share people's content out and stuff like that. And then YouTube changed it, and, and you know you get to you can do it before you got to four hundred. And then I got close to four hundred. Next time, now now I'm at what six hundred or something. Mm -hmm. So you can tell you can tell Rob is from Michigan. He's like, how do you get four hundred sixty three lakes? <laughs> Rob's got four hundred sixty three lakes before. He's got four hundred sixty three lakes. lakes. Lakes, lakes. Yeah, lakes. I just see that. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Sorry, yeah. Rob. Just kidding. I mean, I, awesome. I wish I could get 460 something likes on my videos. What what the heck? Me too. Yeah, never in my life. I think that's the most likes in all my videos. 708 subs. Oh. Hey, that's why I've got more than one property, Rob. I know where to hide, buddy. <laughs> I build bunkers. I'm just kidding. I just oh look like God. I build bunkers. You got 708, yeah. Slimster. I'm That's trying to get all you guys to go. I'm trying to get all you snobby people to come out to my house and camp out, man. Do some scary. I got a big 10-foot screen out in the middle of the woods. Watch scary movies on. We get oh. Adam drunk. No, we won't get Adam drunk. He end up in the pond naked with somebody. We can't oh. do that. Well, it will be fine. I'll stay sober. It'll be fine. <laughs> no, well, I'm just kidding. Yeah, no, it would be a lot of fun. You know, I got drunk so one time so bad, I don't remember the whole entire day at all. Dude, I'm not telling my drunk stories because I mean, they were telling me I was playing, trying to play basketball, hanging from a tree. I don't know what else what I was doing, and or oh, trying to swim in a freaking little pond or something. Oh. Hold on, you could have stopped that they caught me trying to play basketball. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's I mean, true. yeah. <laughs> ever, ever since then, I had stopped drinking, and then I started drinking again. But uh, I know my limit this time. I'm not going crazy like that. I can't let Sandy know what I really like. I can't tell her what I'm like when I'm drunk. She ain't never seen me drunk. Mm. Mm. Yeah, we got to keep mm -hmm. that quiet. <laughs> yeah, I cook for everybody. I'd love to do that. Oh, 500 yeah. Likes. You said food, so I'm on my way. I'll be right there. on. If I leave now, I can get there in three days. Maybe three I'll days? Go. Why, where are you at, Adam? <laughs> I live in Utah. Oh, that's right. You said that earlier. Utah. I live... Up in the mouth of a canyon by Provo, if you know where that is. But like Sandria, Sandy is uh, she's the geographical person. I think she knows every lake in the world. Like she knows lakes in Russia. I'm like, who knows la about lakes in Russia? Oh wow, that's pretty. Amazing. Not even Russian knows about lakes. <laughs> she knows. She knows like every exit. You could say I live in such a place. <laughs> she's like, oh, that's exit 19. Oh my goodness. I'm like, nobody knows that. Without looking at a map. Huh. Sounds like Sandra's Sandra said you was a Yeah, she's traveled, man. She wants to <laughs> she wants to she wants us to all go to Colorado so that she can't stand it. <laughs> I the did, buddy. I is that did. She is? <laughs> that was that? me. She's in Colorado. <laughs> she wants to go to Colorado bad, yeah. That's my neighbors. Yeah, she's yes. she spent a little bit of time out there. I've never been. Oh yeah, it's beautiful. It's nice. I like it. It's only like just, a few, what, three hours from my house to get to. I like, love history and I love the outdoors, and that has a little bit of all of that. Yeah, 
It's so one of yeah. It's and if you like a drive, the the drive up through the canyon from my house to Colorado is the most scenic drive I think I've ever seen in the country. And I've yeah. as you said, get around. So I'm not so convinced about driving through some of them mountainous regions. Yeah, they're kind of dangerous out here, but like if it snows, they don't even open the. They'll just keep the road closed up that canyon usually. I lived in Knoxville, Tennessee for a little while on the Knoxville Farragut border. And they, they would shut the whole da town down because they said it was going to snow. And the snow would literally, wait, where am I at? The snow would hit the ground and just kind of like blow across the street. And they shut the whole town down because of that. Wow. If this snows too flurries, the school shut down, the bank shut, everything shuts down. Man, that would be nice. I could never get out of school when I was younger. Man, oh, dude, yeah. in Indiana, we get tons of snow, and I went to school in the ghetto, and I'm telling you, I remember, like, the blizzard what was at 78. People were still going to school, and there's a friggin' blizzard outside. Yeah, um, I remember that, too, yep. yeah. They don't care here. Oh, hey, yeah, Rob, yeah. I'm going to try and come to uh, – I'm definitely trying to come to um, uh, Branson. Branson. That was on my list. I had a little bit of a crazy start to this year, so I'm having to reevaluate stuff, but – yeah. I would love. He said, "I better not show my face." So, uh oh, you better show. All right, guys, I gotta let I'm you guys good. go. You guys have a blessed day. I'll see you guys. Uh, maybe what Saturday tomorrow? Yeah, oh, Sean's yeah. live. Okay. Yeah, so yeah, I better get out there too. Yeah, we got a um, big, big day tomorrow too. Yeah. Oh, have a. Yeah, it's, it's uh, we we been passing one hour mark, so I guess we need to go ahead and yeah. end it. Okay. So, uh, I hate to. Uh, the uh, 400 and some likes. That's, yeah, that's awesome. Crazy. Yeah. Well, that's thanks crazy, for having man. me up, Slim. Thanks, right, everybody. Make yeah, sure you thanks, like, man. subscribe to Bad Recon. Uh, yeah, Bad Recon. And remember, I, on Tuesdays, my live, I'm also try, I'm gonna try to we're gonna try to play some games and get, do some giveaways here. Who's Bad Recon? Uh, some crazy young guy by like. 15 feet tall, 12 inches. I heard in some circles they call him Bat Freaking. <laughs> <laughs> no, Bat Freaking. He doesn't even know his is um, his sister. <laughs> 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 All right, guys. Have a blessed day. Hey, I love you guys, man. Take care. See you, Bat Freaking. See you tomorrow. Bye. Hey, I want to thank everybody in the chat for coming. Uh, thank you for the likes. Uh, thank you for subscribing to each other's channels. Uh, show that support to each other. Let's grow together. Thank y'all, panel, for coming up. Adam, ET, good Thank having y'all. Thanks, Sean, Thanks. Thank And uh, tomorrow, Sean, you go live. Hopefully, I'm gonna be out uh, at the HorrorCon tomorrow um, and the tattoo convention. Oh, so sweet. Busy, busy day tomorrow, so I'm not sure if I'm going to make it home. If I do make it home in time, I'm not sure if I'm going to have the energy <laughs> to do a live stream. But I'll meet you over at Horicon. That sounds amazing. But, uh, yeah, you know, I might, you know, so watch for that uh, notification. And uh, and you're going to try to go live tomorrow while you're walking around? Oh, yeah, definitely I'll be going live for a little while at least and uh, take you guys around the Horicon cool. there. Adam, what's your Try out that uh, vertical format. Get it. What's, what's going on with you, Adam? Uh, oh, tomorrow, uh, Sunday, I'm going to post a video of the 2017 eclipse, actually, now that I think of it, just to kind of show you guys what to expect. And then um, I'll be in New York on the eclipse and we'll go live then. I guess I'll try a vertical live at the eclipse, huh? That's a drive. Well, yeah, I won't be driving. We'll <laughs> I'll fly. It's a long flight too, yeah. But yeah, so I'll be doing that, um, and then just trying to get back to normal, posting every Sunday. I haven't done it in you know quite a few months, but I'm back. So let's try it. See how it goes. Is um, et what you got going on? Supporting no. you, talented people. I'm supporting the real talent. <laughs> no, you got to start liking your own videos first. You oh man, okay. Stuff. I'll and try that. Yeah, yeah, just gotta get past that little that little cringe factor. Right. <laughs> it, it does take a little bit of a mental effort. I gotta be honest. So, I have uh, no shame, so I'm just like, whoop, like, like yeah, that. I one. do it all the time too. Man. Yeah, 
a like is a like. <laughs> yeah, get it. After waiting 50 hours for him to upload, I just want to get away from it for a little bit. <laughs> I should circle back around, I guess, though. So what time is the eclipse Monday? Oh, the eclipse is on the, the 8th of April, right? 8th of April, but it's not till like 3 p.m. Eastern. In April, two o'clock or two o'clock for Indiana, or ET. Two o'clock for Indiana, three o'clock for New York, like three thirty ish, I think, somewhere around there. And it's going to be the longest one that we'll have seen in this country. So, yeah, in I did. a long, long time. So, you got your uh, your filters and stuff with the phone on the camera. Um, I do. Yeah, I do. I'm going to see if it works. Hopefully, we'll see yeah. how it goes. Hopefully we'll have a big white spot in the middle of our camera after the eclipse. <laughs> I hope not. Currently. <laughs> yeah, I learned that the hard way at the last eclipse. It ruined one of my cameras. <laughs> wow. I, I didn't know it did such a thing, but now I do. So, yeah, I've definitely got those those filters. Excuse me. But, yeah, you'll have to show well, us thank you when you see it, too. Absolutely. And, uh, I appreciate each and every one of you. Love all of you. Thanks and we'll see y'all at the next live. Bye, y'all. Bye, guys. Bye, y'all. Peace.